we're going to engrave some metal components. They all need to be serialized. So I'm using a Corel Draw again here uh, for serialization. You could also use uh, Bartender or Engrave Lab software. It works really well. But uh, just for a basic tutorial, we're just going to run through this. I've got the metal components set up in the laser. You'll see that on the video feed. I don't really worry about where my artwork is placed on screen here. I just want to print it over to the laser. And then we're going to use camera view to locate the individual components. So there's a the camera view. You can see our components in there. Um, I'm going to ungroup this so I can move these around all independently. And so I'm going to put this right over here. I want to line it up maybe on this edge. And then I'll do the second one here. Move it over using camera view again. And then number three. We'll drop right down here. And then number four, we'll move over to this side. Uh, once we've got the artwork placed where we want it using camera view, we're going to import the laser parameters. We've got the F theta 254 lens installed in here. There's our deep engraving function. I'm just going to import that. And then you'll see that we've got four different hatch angles set up in here. Um, it's also got a cleanup pass. I'm gonna just gonna set this to two hatches per. We don't need to go really deep into this fairly soft aluminum. And then we're gonna send the job over to the laser. I'm gonna call this deep engrave. And then we'll send it over to the laser system. I've already focused the, uh, the Galvo to the top of the components there. So I'll just go to the jobs menu on the list. There it is. And then I hit the go button.